Okay, uh, today I got something just a little fun for you. Uh, it's uh, just a road map, really, um, but it's from Bulgaria, and it's from the late 60s. It looks like 1966 or 67. Um, again, just a, just a road map. Uh, the reason why I got this is because I collect all things Soviet. Um, like I said, I love, well, I, mean, I shouldn't say I love the Soviet Union, but I'm fascinated by it. And while I know this is not actually part of the Soviet Union, it was part of the Eastern Bloc, which I consider close enough. I mean, it's, uh, you know, it, it was under the sphere of influence of the Soviet Union, I'll put it to you that way. So I thought it was kind of cool. And like I said, I got an antique store, it's just a few bucks. So like I said, as you can see, I mean, it's just a, just a road map, just shows the, the main streets and things. And of course, everything is in uh, Cyrillic. So I'll show you this one. This shows the whole country here a little better. So yeah, so it's uh, again just a road map, uh, kind of kind of cool. Like I said, it's uh, I mean, of course, I can't read anything from this at all. You know, but you can see it's just your basic map, as everything. But I just thought it was kind of cool. I mean, late sixties. You know, Soviet era, um, like I said, Eastern Bloc, I guess would be probably the proper way to say it, considering that it was not, you know, part of the Soviet Union, or officially part of the Soviet Union. Um, just, uh, they were a communist, or socialist, if you want to say, uh, state. So that shows the date there, 1966. And again, this has the, uh, some of the verbiage, I don't know, places of interest, things, and I have no idea. Yeah, so I thought it was kind of fun. Like I said, I picked this up at an antique store. Uh, it's just a few bucks, nothing too crazy. Uh, but I thought it was pretty cool. And, uh, yeah, like I said, you can see this, this little picture here. So, yeah, so just, uh, like I said, it's a late 60s roadmap from Bulgaria. Pretty simple thing, but just kind of a fun little item. And, uh, I don't know, it just, it just kind of amazes me. That especially something like this could end up in, uh, you know, small town Michigan. I say, you never know what you're going to find until you get out there. So that's it. Just a quickie. Thanks.